Hi everyone, I am Céline Rémy, the Intimacy Angel, and in today's video, I am going to try to convince you to turn the lights on during sex. So if you are one of those people who are shy and just feel so much more comfortable in the dark, or you are dreaming of the day that every light is going to be on on you and your partner, then give this video a thumb up and make sure you subscribe to my channel. Now, did you know that a study revealed that 75% of people have the lights off during sex? I think it's crazy. And I'm gonna give you three reasons why I think this needs to change. Number one, it will be more intimate. When the lights are on, you are going to be able to look into each other's eyes. And when you do that, you create a connection with your partner. There's something really special to share a moment of vulnerability or to share your pleasure with somebody else and being willing to be fully seen in your pleasure as well as sharing that with someone else. And I know that for some, it can be really frightening to hold somebody else's gaze and really be seen in that moment. But intimacy, if you break it down, breaks down to into me see. I mean, I know it sounds cliche and a little silly, but this is really what it comes down to. When you are making love with somebody, you want to be able to deep, look into their eyes and and create that bonding and connection number two it will bring you closer to one another so when you think of having the lights on what happens like guys are visuals most guys are visuals a lot of women are visuals too no light no sight so you're not going to be able to get to the full your full ability of feeling turned down and excited. But it has more to do also with being willing to create connection with your partner and start to talk about what you want and like and just having this container that's being created where you get to see each other fully. When you are just interacting in the dark, it's kind of like you are withholding a part of yourself. And maybe you are not turning the lights on because you're feeling too shy about yourself or you don't like some of your body parts. And that's definitely something that you need to work on and something to focus on because it starts with you. So being able to feel confident and comfortable enough in your body to be willing to have the lights on will also help you have more self-esteem about yourself and love yourself more. And trust me, when you see your partner's eyes, the way he gazes into you, the way he looks at you or the way she looks at you, like desiring you, it will boost your self-esteem and it will boost your confidence. Number three, you get to see each other's reactions and bodies and really know what you want and what you like. And if you want to be a great lover in bed, and I'm sure you do because you're watching this video, you need to be able to pay attention because noise alone, I'm not going to give you the entire story. It's too easy to fake orgasms or just to make it sound like, oh, I'm into this. But you need to be able to pay attention to a body and the body's response, especially when you are dealing with a woman. You need to see that her clitoris is becoming engorged, her labias are becoming swollen, that the color of her lips and her labias are changing. Like so many little things can be happening that are giving you pointers as whether or not what you're doing is working. Without the light, you're just relying on whatever feels good to you and whatever you're thinking you're hearing and that is not giving you the full picture. I mean, really, it's gonna help you take the fumbling and guessing out of the picture, and that's how you can step into becoming a master lover in the bedroom. So remember, you want to have the lights on, just hey, it's more fun when you get to see each other, but it will help you create a deeper intimacy and deeper bonding. You'll have the ability to really connect beyond just the physical as well as on emotional and even spiritual level with your partner. 
It will help you also boost your own sense of self-esteem to be seeing your partner loving's eyes on you. And you're also going to become a better lover because then you'll be able to pay attention to all the little shit and changes and details, which in turn will help you adjust whatever you're doing so that you can give your partner maximum pleasure. So I hope that these reasons were enticing enough and that you're going to give lovemaking in the full light a try. And please let me know in the comments below how that turned out for you. Did you do you prefer lovemaking in the dark and why? Or do you prefer lovemaking with the lights on? So I love to read your comments as always. Thank you so much for watching today's video and I will be seeing you in the next video.